What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. So it's that time of week, your girl, she's feeling ultra pasty right about now. So I thought I would share with you guys my full tanning routine, girl. I have been an avid self tanner for years now. I love it, I live for it, it helps in so many ways. Other than having that like natural looking golden glow all year round because who doesn't want that? It actually helps a lot in the fitness industry. In case you don't know, tanning makes those muscles like pop, girl, okay? I look 10 times toner <laughs> when I have a tan on. So I like to self tan once a week, okay? That's my self care Sunday, self tanning Sunday, more like it. I've tried like every single self tanner out there, believe it, but the one that I've settled on that I really love that I've been using for over a year is from the brand Tanceuticals. Swear by them. Love you. So huge thank you to Tanceuticals for sponsoring today's video. Let's get into it, baby. But if you're not already, definitely hit that subscribe button for new videos every single week. Let's go. All right, guys, step number one, before you do anything else, you gotta exfoliate that skin. What I like to do is when I know I'm gonna be tanning, I exfoliate the night before for a few reasons. Number one, okay, if you have sensitive skin, I don't necessarily have sensitive skin, but especially if you do, it's gonna irritate it a little bit, okay? You're pretty much scrubbing out your skin. <laughs> so you don't wanna apply tanner to irritated skin. No one wants to do that. So I exfoliate the night before, shave my legs, whatever you gotta do, do it the night before, all right? I love Tanceuticals pre-tan exfoliator. It smells so freaking good. It's basically like an all over the body scrubber. Put it on a loofah and you're good to go. So that's how I like to prep. Get all those dead skin cells off your bod because if you don't girl, that tan's gonna adhere to that and you won't look patchy. So step one's already complete. Been there, done that last night. Now, what I'm gonna do is rinse off in the shower, okay? Get all the moisturizer, all the oils, the nasty sweating I do overnight. <laughs> I'm gonna get it all off of me right now, clean my bod off, and have that fresh slate going on. All right guys, so clean slate going on here, no moisturizers, no like baby oil, because I usually do use baby oil after I shower, but we got nothing going on here. But now I'm about to contradict myself and bring in the lotion, because you want to make sure you lotion all like drier patches, like your elbows, your, your knees, you even should do your like armpits. Any place on your body that has like cracks and crevices, you're gonna wanna apply moisturizer, any kind of moisturizer at all. The reason being is when you put your self tanner on, you want it to like glide over those areas, not pull up. Because if you have any dry patches or cracks or anything like that, you'll see it. Once your tan develops, it'll be extra dark here. We're trying to avoid that. So I put moisturizer on my elbows, my knees, my toes, okay, actually my whole foot and my ankle bone, okay? My entire hand and my armpits. Yeah, I know. You gotta prep, all right? You gotta do it the right way. You even go like on the inside here, okay? Cause I don't know about you girl, but I sweat a lot, like a ridiculous amount. And if I'm like sleeping at night or have my arm like this, a little bit of sweat goes on in there, okay? You can't have that tan run, okay? You're just gonna drip it off of you and it's gonna look weird in the morning. Mm -mm. So here I go. Okay guys, next step, the step you've all been waiting for, gonna have to grab yourself a mitt. Tanceuticals sells these dope mitts that have like a mesh backing so your hand is like breathing while doing your thing. I've tried mitts without the mesh and it, my hand literally sweats in it. So thank you Tanceuticals, you thought ahead. So Tanceuticals self tanning body lotion in ultra dark, that's what I use on my skin. This is the prized possession right here, the self tanner itself. I love you. It's the color incorrect, so CC. 
I love their self tanners because they're made of natural ingredients. You got acai berry, mango butter, and vitamin E, so it's really moisturizing, okay? I like that. That's rare to find in self tanners. So the more natural, the better, in my opinion. Now, guys, I'm not gonna lie, I'm only wearing this bikini because I'm trying to keep it PG for you. But normally I'm in the nude, okay? I'm wearing my birthday suit, typically. <laughs> Just gonna put on a little bit, like so. It's like a tan color. The thing with this self tanner is, it does not have a color guide, which means when you put it on, you're not gonna see the darkness come onto your skin. I only do one layer, that's all I really need for that nice natural glow. But it does not show you the tan, it develops and then the tan shows up later. So I just do long swipes and then I blend it in with circular motions like so. Okay guys, look, I'm gonna be real with you. I gotta go get naked now so I can do the rest of my body. I do my whole body girl. Ain't nothing wrong with that. So. I'm gonna go do that, I'll be right back. Okay guys, so now that my tanner is all where it needs to be, I like to throw on like just baggy black sweats. I'm gonna be real. You need at least eight hours for this to develop, so doing it overnight is definitely preferable. Me, personally, I don't have a life, so I do it like whenever. So this is what I'm wearing, you know, just baggy sweats, keeping it nice and dark so the tan don't rub off on it. I do have all white sheets, and I will admit that laying around in the sheets, sweating at night, it does get on my sheets, but it comes right out in the wash, okay? So when I wash it, they're white again. Thank goodness, because <laughs> like everything I own is white, for real. So what I like about this lotion is the fact that it goes on like lotion. Like it feels just like normal moisturizer. There's nothing weird about this type of formula. It feels good on my skin, it feels moisturizing. So this is why I prefer Tanceuticals. Like for this reason, it's more natural, it looks natural, and I just like the overall formula. I will note that it smells like coconut. It's got that coconutty smell. The actual self tanner, this lotion, smells very potent. It is very potent coconut, right? You also do have like a face tanner, so you can get your face to match your body. I've used it before, it works very well. But I'm super particular with my skincare. When it comes to my face, I like to just use my serums, my moisturizers, like just, I'm very particular with that, so I don't normally wear this, but I have before and it works really well. It matches real nice with the tan. Okay guys, so now we have to wait the eight hours. It is 12.30 p.m. right now, which means at 8.30 p.m. is when I'm gonna be rinsing off. So, I'm gonna rinse off, and then tomorrow morning, I will show you the final results. Till then. Good morning. What's up? So, here we are. This is the final product. Girl, yeah. Mm-hmm. What you think? Loving it, loving it. So as you can see, like since I didn't tan my face, you could definitely see the difference here, okay? Look a little pale, and look in some golden type of way everywhere else. Don't mind this little like spot here next to my collarbone. I could not stop scratching this bug bite last night. So that's what that is. <laughs> this tan does not streak, as you can see, no streaks here. I love it for that reason. It just looks nice and golden tan. Girl, I'm telling you, yesterday, my gains, they were gone with the wind. Now? Now? <laughs> and I just wanna make note too, for those guys that are watching, this is not just for girls either. My bae uses this stuff. He loves it, okay? He says the same thing I do. Your gains pop. So this tan, usually lasts me about a week, I would say. After the five day mark, you really start to notice like shades just kind of going away. All of a sudden you start looking a little lighter, a little lighter at around day seven or eight. Girl, you gotta re-up. A couple of things I suggest doing 
uh, Tanceuticals has a like a post tan lotion. It's really important to keep your skin hydrated because if it's dry and you're not keeping it nourished and hydrated, it's gonna just flake off, okay? It's gonna start like flaking off onto your clothes and things like that. At least for me, that's what happens. So this is an everyday tan extender from Tanceuticals. It smells so freaking good. It still has that coconutty smell like the beach but better. It's like, ooh, yeah, I love it. So it's meant to help maintain that tan. And also another tip is to not shower as long, which is very difficult for me because I love long, hot showers, man. Like 20 minutes. But don't do that, okay? In fact, I, I like narrow it down to like a couple minutes and I'm out. Try not to like stand directly under there for a long period of time. So those are a couple tips I have and uh, yeah. Nice way to stay tan all year round. So even though I didn't tan my face, I mean, there's a noticeable difference, different shades going on here. I do use makeup when I need to, like when I'm leaving the house or I'm filming, I'll put on a, a shade of makeup that like matches this. So that's always a nice alternative if you don't want to put the tanner on your face, but that's just me. Okay, you guys, that was it. Holy hell, look at my face and my tan. <laughs> Two different worlds right now. <laughs> guys, there's so many benefits to self-tanning. Not only is it a healthier alternative than being like right out in the sun, a lot better than tanning booths. I used to do that. I don't touch tanning booths now, all right? And it's just an easy way to have that golden glow all year round. It's effortless, really. Once you get your routine down, it's easy breezy. Like there's, you don't even think about it. At this point in my life, I couldn't live without self tanning. I don't wanna see myself not living with self tanning, especially when you're in like the fitness realm, okay? You work for your gains, you work to just sculpt and tone your body. So to reach its full potential, get that golden glow going, you know, and uh, really maximize them gains that you work for. And definitely do some research, like depending on your skin tone, what shade you should be going for. Tan Suicles, I'm wearing the ultra dark, like I said. Uh, they also have light, you know, medium skin tone colors, so it could look a little, you know, less tan if you prefer that, if it would look more natural on your body. So definitely give them a check. I will have everything linked down below. They are very affordable, okay, compared to a lot of self tanners out there, because girl, I've tried them all. So that was it, that was my full tanning routine with Tanceuticals, baby. Hope you enjoyed this video, found it helpful. Comment down below if you have any questions, girl, because I tell you, I've been doing this for my long, so. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for new videos every single week on all things fitness. And yes, tanning is a part of fitness, obviously. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.